Here's another result concerning expectation. Given a random variable x, could be discrete, could be continuous, and functions g1 of the random variable x and g2 of the random variable x, then the expected value of g1x plus g2x is the expected value of g1 of x plus the expected value of g2 of x when the expected values exist. This is another example of why expected value is known as a linear operator. Again, the proof will be in the continuous case only. In the discrete case, integrals are replaced by summations. The expected value is e of g1 of x plus g2 of x, whatever is in the brackets here winds up going right here in front of the probability density function of x. So since it's continuous we integrate and since the support is not pinned down we go all the way from negative infinity to infinity that will cover everything. Notice that these two integrals here can be broken out into g1 f of x dx and g2 f of x dx this first integral is the expected value of g1 of x. The second integral is the expected value of g2 of x. And so when those expectations exist, we have a proof of the general result.